Grand Rapids, Michigan, and I grew up in a very small town called Manistee, Michigan, which is sort of by the pinky. And when I was about six or seven, my dad took me to see a production of The Most Happy Fellow. And um, during one of the scenes, a little girl my age came across stage wheeling on a birthday cake of some kind, and I was like, what? Nobody told me this was happening? Why didn't anyone call me? <laughs> and so I was just kind of shocked that people were doing this, and I, um, when I realized that people were doing it as their jobs, the everyday grown-up jobs, I was just totally sold. I was introduced to the Twilight Saga during the last, um, the last book, Breaking Dawn. You know, I was introduced to fandom in its largest sense, and um, it was wonderful because I was able to meet a very passionate, joyful, loyal fan base that has continued to stick with me now you know, three years later. Um, so I was first introduced to the script for By the Way, Me, Vera Stark um, when they were preparing for the New York production. And I was blown away by it because I don't think that people are writing for black actresses in this way. It was just, it, it spanned so many decades. It was really an epic um, journey for um, for the, her the heroine, and uh, it got me so excited. And um, I think that this script really uncovers um, our history in a really interesting way. Partly, you know, through some of the ugliest I think, parts of it are through the screwball comedy in Act One. And so you're able to, we're able to laugh at ourselves, laugh at what we thought was true drama, laugh at what we was tugging at our heartstrings then in this sort of heightened format.